Hello Aquarius, how are you? Welcome to my channel, Star 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 and welcome to your reading. So Aquarius, this is your reading for the month of November 2021 and this is a general reading. Take what resonates and leave what doesn't. Energies might be vice versa and time is fluid. Okay, also Aquarius, I would appreciate if you would hit like, share and subscribe and comment down below if you find yourself getting resonated with this reading. I would also request you to hit that notification bell so that you will be notified whenever I upload the videos. Aquarius, uh, in this reading, we'll see what is your energy, what is the energy of the person you are thinking about, you are dealing with, what is the mutual energy between you and this person. Okay? So, let's get started now. Uh, this person can be a past person. This person can be a new person coming your way. Alright. So, we have world. We have is the lovers. And we have three of cups. Beautiful. Eight of cups. Then we have is the chariot. And ten of cups wow aquarius okay then we have is five of pentacles and queen of wands mm -hmm. then let's pull out some love notes i'm going to lay down the love notes now we'll discuss them at the fag end aquarius by the way you may be dealing with a gemini you may be dealing with a cancer you may be dealing with a uh, taurus leo scorpio another Aquarius beautiful so these are your cards aren't they beautiful the world the lovers and three of cups Right. Aquarius with that world card, I can definitely say that things are changing. And things are changing on a larger scale. But you don't know that. A lot of things are happening behind the curtain, behind your back. And when I say things are changing, they are changing for positivity. I mean, they are... Uh, they are changing because positive things are are uh, are about to happen in your life okay with that world card i definitely sense you have either completed or you will complete certain cycles mostly i feel like uh, whosoever is yet to complete the cycle the end of 2021 will mark a major shift in your life okay it is seriously going to be a major shift. Somehow I'm sensing that the 2022 is the year where a lot of sudden changes are about to happen in your life. A lot of sudden changes. Okay. And this is the kind of energy I am getting for you Aquarius since a very long time. Uh, most likely I'm getting this energy about 2022 probably from August, September, October okay and as we are nearing 2022 this energy is only becoming stronger that there are going to be some sudden changes in year 2022 for you aquarius okay you are closing a lot of chapters uh with that world card i'm also sensing that for some of you there will be some sudden relocations okay uh maybe you will relocate to another country for job or for education or for uh uh what shall i say uh, maybe you will find someone from a different country and you will get relocated to that person's country okay somehow i feel like things are gonna change and they are gonna change at a rapid pace okay like the kind of life you will be experiencing in 2022 is going to be so different as compared to any of your previous years uh, so when I say different, most likely I feel like you will be exposed to an extremely different environment and extremely different culture. So that is one of the reasons why I see that relocation is a very strong possibility for you Aquarius. A very strong possibility in 2022. Like you may not even know right now, 
but maybe all of a sudden in the mid of the year or maybe the second half of the year or even you will start preparing yourself from the first half of the year itself for relocation okay uh what i see is that that relocation that shift in the energy uh is going to bring so much of change in your life you will be exposed to different people you will be exposed to different cultures uh and i see that the people with whom you have been interacting so far in your life interaction with those people or uh, yeah interaction with those people is going to reduce to a large extent secondly uh uh yeah interaction you will deal with these people the people that you have dealt with so far in your life you are going to deal with those people very less moving ahead from 2022 for some of you if if anyone is staying from with your family i see that you will move away from your family okay uh for whatever reasons i see a distance between you and your family okay uh it may be sad initially but later on later on you will you will experience that much needed freedom you you will have that space in your life to invite someone in your life okay uh it's not only for people who are going to move away from their family but it is almost applicable for everyone the shift which is going to happen in your life whether relocation happens or not there is going to be a shift in the energy in 2022 okay and because of that shift in the energy you are going to create some space in your life to invite invite people in your life these people most likely i'm i'm sensing is is going to be romantically related to you we have lovers card there is a strong possibility that you will find the love of your life you know what aquarius it is it is usually being said okay whether you most likely this is what i've heard about or this is what i've read for aquarius moon sign but forget about moon sign sun sign or rising okay or what whoever you are as per the tarot cards and the kind of energy i'm sensing usually for aquarius once they are in their 30s okay and most likely past 33 34 35 after these years you start experiencing major changes in your life okay whether you are a sun moon rising or whatever okay or venus or okay you guys you start experiencing major changes major important critical changes in your life in your 30s okay till your life till 30s your life till 33 34 35 it it is a big struggle for you guys okay and uh, but again this is not universal for some of you you may experience uh, abundance quite early you may experience important changes quite early okay but this is what i have read this is what also uh me being an aquarius i am also experiencing that okay uh this is what i have a sensed in for many other aquarius uh, this is what i have i've seen for many other aquarius people and yes astrologically also this is what is being said okay uh, aquarius people usually experience hardships in their life uh, from the start on till their 30s okay and later on they 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 uh, there is a major shift okay and what i'm sensing is like the year 2022 is is going to mark major changes in your life aquarius okay there there are going to be some major major changes uh like i told you relocation is there for whosoever is studying study study whosoever is studying whosoever is planning to appear for some competitive exams or whosoever is planning to apply for some schools or colleges whosoever wants to go back to school or colleges or even whosoever wants to go go and apply for some online courses i see 2022 is going to be that year and or you will start preparing for those exams and all that stuff and you will get admissions wherever you want and whatever you are going to do education wise that is going to bring extreme abundance to you okay the kind of knowledge you will have you will impart that knowledge to the world and you are going to create lot of abundance for yourself 
okay apart from that what i'm sensing is in uh, apart from education what i'm sensing is when it comes to love okay you're going to meet someone you're going to meet the love of your life aquarius and this love is hmm this love can be a twin flame this love can be a soulmate most likely i'm getting a strong soulmate energy for some of you it will be a twin flame okay and this person is there to stay in your life they are there to stay in your life the moment you guys meet aquarius you guys will feel like i've known this person since ages okay like literally literally that's again i'm hearing that that <laughs> that dialogue from uh bram stoker's dracula i've crossed oceans of time to meet you right so probably you your soul and their soul has been searching one another since many lifetimes yes this is a past life uh, soulmate but somehow i'm sensing that the you were not together for recent past lifetimes okay so this their soul has been searching your soul since 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 ages okay and you are also searching their soul since ages in fact i'll say aquarius that one of the reasons whosoever is planning for relocation or for whosoever relocation is about to happen okay one of the reasons why relocation is about to happen is because you're going to meet this person wherever you're staying right now aquarius i'm very sure you are you're feeling that you are a misfit in that place you are feeling like say for example uh you may have felt like i don't you know in whichever family you may have uh you may have born probably you feel like maybe i don't be, i don't belong here okay the the kind of values uh my family members carry it's they are probably different than what i think or what i believe okay your beliefs your faiths are different as compared to your family members or forget about family uh, wherever you are born in maybe in the country or the city or the state where you are born in you feel like i you have been continuously feeling like i'm a misfit over here i belong somewhere else i belong somewhere else okay and your soulmate is staying where where you belong okay and that's where you're going to get relocated to okay again whosoever is whosoever will not get relocated i see some travel happening for you guys in 2022 and that's how you will meet this person i see a very strong possibility aquarius a very very strong possibility i'm again repeating i see a very strong possibility you guys meeting your soulmate in 2022 2022 is going to be the year for you guys when you're going to meet your the one okay for majority of you i see that we also have three of cups it's going to be time for celebration lovers and three of cups you will be so relieved like finally after so many years of hardship finally after going through so many wrong relationships finally after you know uh, experiencing so much of betrayal experiencing so much of uh, manipulation or whatever all uh, toxicity in the relationships finally i'm finding my soulmate finally i'm finding my the one okay now this person can be different let me tell you okay uh like say for example you may have a different ex- accent they may have a different accent you may belong to a different country they may belong to a different country uh it may be like uh yeah ethnicities may be different cultural upbringings may be different but when both of you will meet all the differences will get dissolved like literally all the differences will be dissolved even if there is an age gap of 10 years 20 years 30 years whatever it is all differences will be dissolved i'm using the word dissolve okay you'll absolutely feel like there are no differences between both of you you just you just complete one another the moment you see one another that is going to be the feeling for one another like yes this person is mine and they are going to feel like yes aquarius is mine like i i see like once you become comfortable with one another you will ask one another like where were you for so many years i've been searching you for so long where were you 
okay congratulations aquarius i'm very happy for you i'm very very happy for you okay and look this is the opportunity that is going to come your way in 2022 okay it's it's not like the opportunity is going to stand outside your door like hey i'm knocking your door open the door i'm this opportunity okay you have to take this opportunity no even you have to be a bit alert even you will have to listen to your mind your body and your soul when the opportunity comes your way if the opportunity comes your way and out of fear you just refuse to listen to your mind body and soul this opportunity is going to go away then again this cycle will continue for many lifetimes okay As far as your person is concerned, we have eight of cups, the chariot, and we have is ten of cups. Okay. So, Aquarius, first of all, if you haven't removed someone from your life who is not meant to stay in your life, please remove them. Okay, you're being advised to walk away uh this can be a past person this can be anyone who needs to exit from your life and you may be like yeah i'm not in touch with this person i have blocked this person but this person is there in your energy stop going through the social media stop searching them on the internet they have to go they have to go away from your life they have to they you have to clear your energy okay you need to remove this person's energy from your energy so even if you are like no star i am not in touch with them no i have blocked them no 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 what i'm saying is i believe that you still think about them intermittently this person's energy has still occupied some space in your energy and universe is telling me that even if you had invested a lot in this person which i can clearly see with that with those eight of cups okay you you are being advised to walk away just walk away please walk away okay we have chariot after you walk away you will give space for someone new to come your way to come and enter in your life and like i told you whosoever is coming in your life they are here to stay okay this person is gonna be the one for you aquarius okay this is the one for you these are some beautiful cards i hope you're able to see them <laughs> okay wait i don't know why i just wish to show these cards to you okay so something good is about to happen but you need to free yourself from something okay and so for some of you i'm also getting that there will be a test for you before you really reach to this ten of cups situation before you find yourself in that happy satisfied a long-term relationship okay there may be a test one or two tests for you like universe will send towards you one or two people and universe will be like let me test aquarius have they learned their lessons well or not are they capable of rejecting the wrong people or not or just because they want someone in their life they are ready to accept anyone any damn person in their life okay have aquarius learned their lessons or not okay so walk away from someone you need to walk away from someone or something abundance is waiting for you okay you are meant to rise up in your life don't hold you hold back your abundance so the love notes that you have options is meaningful and rock on what you will what you give will come back what goes around comes around then we have is it's not only about being right you also have to see just don't see what is the end conclusion please learn to see behind the curtain also see how much efforts were being taken towards a certain situation create space for new love are you kidding me are you kidding me look at this 
Eight of Cups, Five of Pentacles, and create space for new love. You you are still carrying your previous person's energy, Aquarius. Okay, like for how long? How long you want to carry this person's energy? And do you really delay these blessings that are coming towards you? Do you want to delay this? Do you want to delay this? How long you want to carry your past person's energy? You know yourself what is good for you. Okay, you are not ready to accept that. Love doesn't have to mean near. Someone from far off a distance is coming. There is a deeper reason for each of your questions. Just seek it. They chose you. They chose you. Your soul mate has chosen you. Hubba hubba. You know that dreamy look of deep soulful love you are sometimes seen in the eyes of another as they have gazed into your own. Expect a lot more of it. Wow. Wow. Okay. Experience that eye to eye contact gazing into one another's eyes beautiful i'm i just love this i hope this resonates hit like share and subscribe and comment down below till then bye bye